I loved the House Pets comic. The character cast is amazing and dynamic, the humor is varied and well scripted, and it really feels like it evolves throughout the years that Rick Griffin spent making the comic. It's got some adult themes, but at this point everything in life does, so I'm not even sure why I commented on that, or scripted this in the first place. Anyways, I spent probably more than 20 hours reading this comic because reading threads or looking up the character cast online to see if I could find anything that I'd missed. I think if you, the viewer, were to read this, you would also probably enjoy it as much as I did. Especially when the plot picks up during the Heaven's Not Enough plot, or the Temple Crashers, or even Heck Razor. Yes, it's really called Heck Razor, there is literally zero profanity in this comic whatsoever, despite occasional adult themes. It began on June 2nd, 2008, or at least was posted on June 2nd, 2008, I'm sure the project started earlier, it would later develop into a complete series with its own unique art style that evolves along with it. As of posting this, Rick Griffin is still taking a break from posting the comic, however it's scheduled to continue. At some point. Please. I really need more of this content, I really need some more furry comic to read. So, fanboying aside, here are some of my favorite parts of this comic. I love the diverse cast and artistic expression to the point where I harassed my friends until we recreated these comics our ourselves. Oh, and real quick, obligatory recurring joke time. Hey, hey kid, you like spoilers? Well I've got- wait a second, didn't you do this last video? Who are you? I don't even know why I scripted this. Uh... Meanwhile... Don't you have anything besides just hit her? Excuse me for optimizing our strategy. If you're bored, princess, I need to test your taunt skill. How do I do that? You taunt her? You're adopted! So are you! I don't think that worked. Thank you for your enlightened contribution to the cause. King! You're in dire peril! You must- Ugh. Something interesting needs to happen around here. And fast. Okay. Thank you, universe, but um, that was a rhetorical statement. Hey, Tarmac, Gambit. Hey, Peanut. How are my favorite river otters? Couldn't be better. In fact, they just brought in a female last week. Gallo de chico, estoy cansándome. Escandaloso. Though we think she's supposed to be in the other pen. You mean she ought to be? <laughs> I got a marble. Hey, I got a piece of flint. I got a bone. I got chocolate. Now, I was never big on uh, political cartoons back when I was in school. I always thought they were kind of hard to understand, so I'll make this one as clear as possible to understand. Read Morgan, Obama, Pork United Barrel, United States, Iraq, the economy. If you didn't understand that, I, I don't know what to tell you. Bailey, I'm just saying. Just saying? All you're doing is just saying. It's not an ideal situation, but I'm trying to make it better, and you are chewing at the wound. So what are you just saying? Uh, dogs like chewing wounds? Hey, cat. Oh, sorry. You smelled like a cat. Also, Nitro, are you crying? Something wrong? I don't want to talk about it. It's okay if you don't want to say. I'll just walk with you, because it's always nice to have someone around. I don't want anyone following me either. Oh, okay. Sorry. Aren't you going to go home? No. Daddy locked me out again because I didn't get him any babes at the party. I think he just forgets when he's mad. Scooch over. Oh boy! It'll be like a sleepover, except without beds, or pillows, and it's freezing cold, and there's no food! Santa, this year I learned that I could write to you, so you would know what I want for Christmas. So I guess all I want is a new rawhide bone, and a DVD set of Justice League, and a copy of Animal Crossing City Fold. And that you could give Grape some awesome cat things, and deliver righteous judgment unto your enemies. For yours is kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Dad, someone's at the door. Hi there, I'm from PETA. 
Akira Sojo. 100% big time fight. Robot attack time! Man, why are you watching this junk? What? I thought you liked Akira Sojo. Yeah, I like the OVA, which is why I'd never watch it dubbed. You need to watch it correctly if you want to catch all the subtleties. Akira Sojo, 100% subete no jikan no saidai no tatakai. Jikan wa robot no kugeki! You know, this is just like the subtleties between Naruto and One Piece. Did you know both One Piece and Naruto are based off or inspired by the story called Journey to the West? However, despite that being the case, they're so different, you could argue that not being the case. Isn't that funny? Some spoilers are incoming. Your lawyer will be arriving shortly with a change of clothes for you. Good morning, Joel. You're not my lawyer. Oh, come on. Is that your best line? You're supposed to say something like, So, we'll be switching to an insanity plea? You seem more accepting of this than usual. I figured there was no use resisting anymore because I'm dead, and this is purgatory. Good job. That was 5 minutes and 10 seconds. My turn to hide, and this time you'll never be able to find me. 48, 49, 50. Ready or not, here I come. <laughs> It can be so predictable. Mom paid me a dollar to get you in here. Treachery! Get up. Your trial is prepared. So, uh, why'd you chain yourself to the wall? Cause heaven has no style when it comes to dungeons. the griffin. You walk the line between a burdened and a callous spirit, but for the time being I see no destructive intent in you. However, your stunt is complicated matters for the celestial democracy. You are barred from the heavens until such time this court sees fit. You must sit an additional hundred thousand years in solitary confinement. And don't do it again. And that is why I like subjective time. Sir, sorry to interrupt, but the charity bus you ordered broke down en route here. What shall I do? Garazet isn't doing anything. Have him order a new one. Yes, sir. Ooh. Jeev said you wanted me to get a- A new bus? Just when I thought it couldn't get any worse. I'm going to give the team just a piece of my mind. How can we have an elaborate, bigger than Times Square setup for New Year's when these screw ups lose the most important piece in transit? I guess you can really say the drop the. No! So they just leave the crawfish in another pot of water? Didn't they already cook it? Now it's to steep the crawfish in things like, you know, pepper, garlic, or. <laughs> Spicy buzz! I want to try. I know what's your money game. We love casting spells. You're giving us a honeymoon too? Sure. I have a dozen houses going on use at any given time. That's generous of you. Provided, of course, that the rock scam or coup will be dope in the moon. Come on, King. Lighten up. It's your party. Have something to drink. Look, I appreciate it, but I'm a total lightweight and don't want- Hey there, sailor. What's your poison? Bailey, what are you doing here? What's wrong? You actually want to get fresh with other girls? That's not how that works. Yeah, that comes after you're married. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here to get through this thing called life. We are here to honor these two. They may have been joined in holy matrimony, reaching this decision either by their own free will or by severe brain damage, either by intent of act of God. Ladies and gentlemen and dogs, if anyone has a reason why these two should not be wed, tell it to my secret goon squad. Four feet is cheating! You were just sore cause you're losing! You were just telling me what you need to talk about. No, Peanut, I don't want you worrying about it for the rest of the date. But, as a small hint, it has to do with... the game. Aw, oh, Terret, uh, you made me lose! Uh... I don't know. I never counted. 
I am not really a math guy, you know? Well, this was a blast to make, and I hope that everyone else that participated enjoyed this as much as I did. I don't think we'll be making another unless people really want to see another one, so I guess let me know what you think in the comments. Did I over-edit this? 100%. Was it fun? Yep. Anyways, I'm done stalling for the beat drop. He recorded almost as many bloopers as actual voice lines. First up is Arnold. I don't think anyone could have played Peanut better than you did, so thanks for helping out with the project. Next up is Bagel. Despite having the least number of lines, your files managed to corrupt my entire folder multiple times. Nancy Pelosi was just too powerful. This is one of my unnamed IRL pals. While we played Dungeons and Dragons for a while, part of the skill set that comes with that is finding clever ways to voice other characters. Certainly got something unexpected. Well done. He forgot half of his lines, but don't worry, so did I. Thanks, though, for being patient with me while I messed up the lines that I sent you probably more than three times. And we've got Mr. Goon Squad himself, it's Boo. Now, we couldn't have done this without the ladies, and boosting their decibel count by around 10. Thanks, Artemis, couldn't have done it without you. Check out her Valor Twitch, or TikTok. She also played Dungeons and Dragons, and even made her school's D&D club. It's a Rixie. Much like my unnamed friend, I was beyond impressed with the voice acting. Electrical engineering doesn't work out with it for you, you should consider professional voice acting. Now, I don't think bilingual or even trilingual are sufficient in your case, but at the very least, he knows Japanese. <laughs> Akira Sojo himself is Juicy Juice. And lastly, your fourth wall break. These credits wouldn't exist without the artist himself guy. Thanks a ton, man. Alright, roll the bloopers. King, you're in dire peril. You must. That's not your line. Uh. Dear Santa, this year I learned that you. F Dear Santa, this year I learned. F Dear Santa. This year I learned that I could write you so you could F Hey dear Santa F Dear Santa This year I learned that I could write you F Dear Santa This year I learned that I could write to you so you would know why Akira Sojo Hyak Pasento Subete no Jikan no Saida no